Okay, so very excited to share with you very, uh, a new feature with iOS 6 that just came out for your iPad, iPhone and all the other goodies you have. Click on the settings menu and when you get into here you want to click on general and this screen will come up. Scroll down to the bottom and click on accessibility. When you're in there look under learning and it will say guided access. Again click on that. It will be off when you go in there for the first time so it will look like this. Turn it on and set a password. And for this demonstration, we will do one, two, three, four. Enter it twice. So it's all set up. Enable screen sleep. We'll leave that as off for now, but that'll put the screen to sleep if you'd like it to. Simply press the home button to go back out. So what does this do? Well, it's amazing for us because um, working with children with special needs and also obviously having a child with special needs, they tend to press the home button and want to go and play with other apps. So here's how it works. You click your app that you want to work on and this is the app, you press your home button three times and you see the guided access comes up. You have the option of turning things on and off. If you don't want them to be able to tilt the iPad, you can turn that off so they can't tilt it. And if you turn the touch off, it would disable the entire screen. So you're obviously gonna leave that on. Now, as soon as you press start, let's see what happens. So press start, guided access has started. You're in the app. You wanna start using the app and so on and you go ahead and use that and let's say they want to get out of it they want to press the home button well I'm pressing the home button and it's telling me guided access is enabled triple press to uh, exit so when I triple press it I now have to enter a password if they don't know that password they can't get out of the app so they are in this app there is no way to get out of it so I think this is fantastic and I just wanted to share that with you and I hope that helps some people